Um, can you tell us a little bit about your characters this season? So Griffin, this season, I would say he is kind of like a, a like a guide because Harper gets stuck in the past and we got to get her back. But Daisy is stuck in the future or the present with Griffin. And so Griffin's got to figure out how to get Harper back to his place. But he's also got to make Daisy kind of feel comfortable and trust Griffin enough to, you know, follow him. And so it's just whole this just whole crazy thing going on. But bunch of mysteries, but yeah, Griffin's definitely like a tour guide. <laughs> cool. And Savannah, she's kind of like providing information, like insider information that they might not know because she spends the most time in the '60s, and there's some new characters introduced to her that she is sneaking some information from. And um, Savannah, she's with her family a lot more this season, and she's helping out with the Tremont, but she's also contributed contributing to this. Um, to Griffin, it's like a big triangle. Savannah's giving information to Griffin so Griffin can help Harper, and I'm also trying to do my part to help Harper. Oh, very cool. And can you add, can you t- tell me three words how you describe how you how you describe Sulphur Springs season two? I would go with mysterious. Uh, it's a little scary, and it, I mean it's fun. It's fun. It's a little, yeah. There's the three words. Okay. I would go with. Fun, yeah, fun as well. Fun, like, oh, I just want to say edge of your seat, but I can't. Um, fun. Suspenseful. Suspenseful, yeah. Fun, That's a good suspenseful, word. Suspenseful and frustrating, because you want to know what happens next, but you have to wait, like, a full week. A lot of cliffhangers. <laughs> yeah. A lot of cliffhangers, that's good. And uh, Griffin, you were talking about how you have to kind of juggle – helping out you know with Harper and um with Savannah yeah sorry um but also how how is it also talk about the character character also juggling helping your parents with the, the Tremont Hotel which I saw in the first two episodes how you have to kind of manage your siblings and all that yeah all that. yeah so I like Griffin's main goal is obviously Harper but he's got to act normal without giving away any of like the portal stuff so his mission will be to go back in time or go out to solve something do will get stopped by his parents. And then he's got to take 20 minutes to do whatever his parents want him to do. Finishes that. Got to go back to what he was doing. So he's got 14 billion things on his mind constantly. And he's got to figure out, you know, how to do each of them without giving anything away. Definitely. And um, oh, so Savannah's now back in the six, as 1960s. And what does her life kind of look now? And um, I know there's something involving a, a camp perhaps, but what do you, Yeah. Yes, I got to boss around some little children, which was very funny. It was very fun. And she is helping to get the 1960s hotel ready. And she gets to spend a lot more time with her mom. And being a camp counselor for a couple of days was very fun since I had like a little whistle. I had like a yeah. uniform and I got to um, well, boss around children, which it's fun. And I do it with my everyday life as well because I have four siblings. So. Oh, nice. <laughs> I just have one little sister, but you know. She's all right, New Hampshire right now. <laughs> Very fun. And uh, thank you so much for speaking with me today. Of course. Thank, thank you so much for having us.